Hi there guys and welcome to another video tutorial for the Pro Business theme. Um, what I'm going to show you in this uh, tutorial is how to control the sidebars. Now, if I just navigate, so this is our theme demo, if I navigate to uh, Home Business version 5, you'll see that on this page we have a sidebar down the right hand side. Now what I'm going to do, so if I just scroll down here you can see we've got the search, we've got the tabs for the different posts, recent and comments recent tweets and, and photos from Flickr. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new sidebar and we're going to, we're going to call it sidebar left uh, and then we're just going to swap this one or uh, remove this one and then put the new sidebar on the left here just just as a quick demo to show you how this works. So the first thing that I want to go into do here is if I just go into the back back end of the website now if we go to the appearance and go to widgets which is where the the default sidebars and everything is set up so we've got all the sidebars set up here so you can see here we've got one called home business version 3 so we've got that there with the different um, widgets in there but we want to create a new one and we want to be able to assign it to that page so what we need to do is we need to click on sidebars under the appearance menu still click on sidebars and we're going to click uh, create a new sidebar so click add new sidebar and then we're just going to call this uh, test sidebar left we'll call it so we'll just do that there we'll just copy that text and we'll just put that in as the key in there so we need to make sure that we've got the key in there so if I save that sidebar and then once that side sidebar is saved if we then go back to um, appearance and widgets We'll then see that we've got that sidebar here. With, there's nothing in it at the moment, so we are ready to um, to start adding widgets to this. So what I'm going to do here is the first thing that I'm going to going to add is I think we'll add a calendar. So we'll put the calendar at the top. So we'll just call that calendar. Um, save that, and then we'll add um, we'll add the search bar in there. So let me find the search. So there's the search. So we'll, We'll drop that in there just underneath and we'll just put that there. Well, in fact, I'll leave that title blank because we just want the search by, so I'll just save that. And then we'll just put um, the tab widget. So if I just find, so we've all these different widgets to work with, so you can drag and drop these into into the different side, into your sidebars and uh, have a look at what we've got there. So w, I'm looking for the news tab widget, so I just need to, there we go. So if I get that, oops, if I get that, drag it, and then if we move to the top here, and then I'm just going to drag that in there. So we've got that in there. Um, so the settings that I'm going to put in here, 323, and leave the tick. So yeah, we'll leave all them on there for now. So that's fine. So if, if I click save on that, that's no problem. So that's that's our title, our test sidebar left setup. So we've got the sidebar set up, we've got all the widgets in there, so now we need to assign it to the page. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna navigate back to the front end of this uh, of our theme demo, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna edit this page. So if I'm just gonna open this in another tab, so we've got the the editor loading in a separate tab, and here, we, here, here you'll see Visual Composer loading and you'll see here now what we've done is within Visual Composer we've created a widget called Widgetize Sidebar so what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete that sidebar from there well what I'll do first actually is I'll just edit that sidebar because if we wanted to we could actually just change it here test sidebar left so we just change it to our sidebar save that and if, then if we preview that see now this page is just loaded and the, t the sidebar on the right hand side has changed so we've got the calendar the search bar and then the the tabbed um, widget that we've got there so you can see here how it's changed from on the preview so what i'm going to do now is i'm just going to move that over to the left hand side and then all we need to do is drag that over to the left hand i've moved that column over to the left hand side and then Again, if we wanted to change from the sidebar that we've just created, we can use that drop down menu there. So if, if I just preview this again now, and this page will load with the sidebar on the left hand side. So you, it just shows you how quickly and easily you can create your content, move it about, 
uh, and with the sidebars you've got unlimited options because you can create unlimited sidebars for each individual page of your theme so hope this video tutorial will help you if you have any questions please contact us at support at cms superheroes.com and we'll be more than happy to help thank you